Berlin. One of Europe's most iconic cities set the scene for round eight of the FIA Formula E Championship. As Lucas Degrassi and the AB team looked to close the gap on Wemi and Renault Edams. The eighth round of the championship. It's all eyes on Buemi, second on the grid. What a chance this is for him to try and close in on championship leader Lucas Degrassi, who's down in eighth on the grid. Radio check. Copy loud and clear. Radio check. Radio clear. All five lights are on, and we go green in Berlin, and it's a very good start from Buemi. Is he going to wrestle the lead away on the run down towards the first corner? Yes, Buemi leads. He's managed to get past Vern, and he moves over, and they all they come into the first corner. Once again, Vern doesn't get the start from pole and Buemi is away in the lead of the race. Sam, how was your launch? Launch was okay, a bit of wheel spin, but with a bit more heat, it should be okay, I think. But look how close Vern is. Vern's going for the lead, up the inside, down into turn one, and Vern retakes the lead of the e -Prix. And there comes Buemi up the inside and he's through, down into turn 10. Buemi finds the room and retakes the lead of the e -Prix. Buemi has more energy. Let's not focus on Buemi, he's out of reach. Here's a look at it again from Buemi. Oh, goodness me, that was close. And that was just about a card switch. Sam Bird is getting a black flag with an orange disc as well, just for that slightly loose front nose. It's not falling off, guys, it's fine. I know, they seem really sensitive. There are already black flags, one or two other cars on this. They seem really sensitive. And there's the look from Daniel Apt, he's got the move done, is he going to get it stopped though? They're both locking their wheels and Apt does get it turned in. So Daniel Apt through into second position. How many more laps can I stay out? No Sam, you need to box now, you've already had two, there's a three maximum, box now, box now. That's ridiculous, it's not falling off guys! Is that the end of Sam Bird's championship challenge? I think realistically it is. You are now put on eight seconds and the third, yeah. Copy. And here comes the look from Prost up the inside, going into the chicane, and he's still not close enough, and Vern loses his front wing. And surely he's not going to be able to hold that position, he's not. Through goes Nico Prost. OK, it seems Prost and you are on the same strategy. It's impossible Prost is the same strategy, he's using much more energy. OK, it looks like he's switched. Degrassi sells the dummy up the inside, and that's third place. Good move, good move. Oh, and out. That's Loic Duval. Has he lost it himself? Oh, there goes the back end. Straight to the scene of the accident. And look how close the grassy is to Daniel Abt. He's got to try and find a way. Can you let Lucas by? He's quicker. There we go. Let Lucas by. He's quicker, is the command to Daniel Abt. No, Daniel, if he doesn't attack Wim, you attack Wim. Try to attack Wim, OK? Copy. No more talking from now on. Are they going to do the swap, the two app drivers? He waves to the inside line. And, well, it hasn't quite worked out there, has it? So final lap started by Sebastian Buemi. He turns through the final corner now, and he wins in Berlin. Victory for Buemi, and Daniel Abt is yeah. going to finish second. Wow. We are second, they drove it in, yeah! Merci les mecs, belle course, pas de cadet. Bravo, Tim, bravo. Victory for Sebastian Buemi. He's closed in on his championship leading rival, Lucas Degrassi. One point between them as we go to the final round in London. You couldn't write it.